This training session, we want to align several objects, um, either horizontally or vertically, and you can use any object you like, whether it be separate objects such as we have here. Um, we have three different objects here, and they can be bitmaps, they can be vectors, they can be uh, any kind of an object, text, it doesn't really matter. But the idea is to get them all aligned, again, vertically or horizontally. So the first thing we want to do is we want to try to uh, capture, let's go all three of these first. So I'm going to left click and drag, and I'm going to encompass all three of them at the same time. And then once I have it, I'm going to come up here to my uh, main menu bar, and I'm going to click Arrange. I'm going to come down here to Align and Distribute. And then with the additional flyout menu here, I can align centers horizontally just by clicking here and as you notice uh, it, they both are all three aligned to the furthest one on the left here I'm going to hit control Z actually I'm just going to come up here and show you under uh, edit again on the main menu bar right here it says undo align or control Z okay so I'm going to just choose that next time I'll just go ahead and use control Z on my keyboard <coughs> Once I have those uh, back together here, I'm going to come back here and say, well, I wanted it aligned with this right here, the center one, this quick start uh, CD cover. So I'm going to click and drag again. This time I'm only going to select the top two. I'm going to hold down my shift key, and then I'm going to left click the third one, which is the quick start right here. And then I'm going to come up here again to arrange, align and distribute, and then come over here again and hit the same thing, align centers horizontally. But watch what happens, what happens this time. You see they both, or all three, align to the quick start. It was the last one that you select. Okay, I'm going to show you uh, something else here very quickly. It's going to do control Z to align these. I'm going to click off for a minute. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to take the top two, hold down my shift key, click on the quick start CD here and this time I'm just going to hit the letter E okay here's where I got that if I come back up to a range on my menu bar click on that um, over here to the align and distribute you'll notice these letters out here on the right these are the hotkeys so if I wanted to very quickly align centers horizontally all I have to do is hit E to align them center uh, vertically I hit the letter C. I can align top, bottom, right, left. Just with the simple uh, touch of a key. Same thing to center of the page. The only thing about center of the page is, let me show you here, um, if I hit the letter P right now, it centers them all three on top of each other to the center of the page. So, I'm going to hit Control Z to back up or undo. And I'm going to hit Control G or come up here to my property bar. Again, see the Control G? That's your quick key or hot key. I'm going to cl uh, click on that. And then I'm going to hit the letter P again. Now I've centered them to the page, but they're all separately in their own position. Okay, I'm going to Control Z one more time for alignment. And one more time, I'm going to hit Control. Actually, I'm going to hit Control U, which is right here ungroup control U okay so these are all separate again one other thing I need to do for alignment is I need to have equal spacing between these so again once I've got them all selected and of course you can do this while they're all selected all at the same time I can come back up here to arrange align and distribute again and this time I'm going to come all the way down to the bottom where it says align and distribute just uh, again and I'm going to hit distribute and I, I want to align these or uh, get them equally spaced and you can do it from the left side from the center from sp equal spacing or to the right well I'm just going to click spacing at this point and I'm going to move this out of the way so you can see what happens just watch the uh, the three down here and I'm going to hit apply and then I'm going to hit close and it automatically sp spaced those three um, equally spaced in between each one according to the furthest one left and the furthest one right. So you could have 10 objects across here and still 
align them just like that and it'll be equally spaced between the furthest left or the furthest right or if you're doing vertically the furthest one from the top and the furthest one from the bottom. Okay now I'm going to go ahead and hit control G to group hit the letter P and I've got them centered I've got them equally spaced and I've got them aligned. Thank you and I hope to see you in the next session.